Hey everybody, Daniel Fusco here and welcome to today's two minute message. So I realized that, you know, as I record this video, it's 2020, start of a new decade and everyone starting this new decade was like, man, this is going to be amazing. And, and really at this point, about more than halfway through uh, 2020, it's kind of, everything's kind of falling apart. Nothing's really kind of worked quite the same way. And it's reminded me of, of something that I, I have to remind myself is that so often as people, we kind of equate God's blessing with everything working out the way that we want it to. Do, don't you do that? I do that all the time. Like, like if everything works out the way I want it to, then God's in it. And if it doesn't work out that way, then maybe God doesn't love me. And I'm here to tell you, Neither one of those things are absolutely true. Sometimes God is in something and it is not exactly what you ever wanted. You don't believe me. You can watch in the Bible how Jesus sent his disciples over the Sea of Galilee and they went right into a storm. So sometimes God sends us into something that's really, really hard. And then on the other side of it, just because God is blessing, just because things are working out doesn't mean that God is in it or God, or just because things aren't working doesn't mean that God doesn't love you. Actually, what God is really interested in all of our lives is in Christ likeness. And he oftentimes uses things that we don't like to reveal to us the issues that are in our hearts so that he can do a refining work. So like, I actually believe that one of the gifts that God has given all of us through this current pandemic that we're going through is as you're revealing a lot of stuff in our hearts, uh, the lack of love, the the, the uh, lack of patience. He's revealing to us that uh, we're just looking for someone to blame uh, and we get really angsty. All these things are part of the revelation of Jesus that happens in our lives when we're kind of squeezed a little bit. And I know nobody likes to really hear that, but listen, just because things aren't working, it doesn't mean that God doesn't love you. Actually, whom the Lord loves, he he chastens. God loves us enough as, as a loving, kind father, not an abusive father, that he puts us in situations that we could grow. And that's exactly what God wants to do in all of us right here, right now. So what I do, first I want you to share this message. And in the comment section, I want you to share a story. Maybe it's a present testimony of where you're kind of feeling squeezed by stuff, but you know that God has grown you up and he's teaching you beautiful things. God bless you.